Hello, good morning, good evening. Uh, wait. Yeah, there you go. Hello, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you are. Welcome, welcome to my channel. My name is Nina. I do some fitness routines, some follow along fitness routines. You can follow along with me. Uh, one word of caution. If you have any surgeries, injuries, please, please don't do exercises or without consulting your doctor. You can do exercises, all the exercises, but after consulting your doctor, okay? Uh, today, uh, we are going to do some abs exercises, uh, focused on abs, completely on abs. And then, um, that's about it. You can repeat the set if you like. He's Leo, my fur baby. He's going to make a cameo from time to time, okay? All right, let's go ahead and get started. First, let's do a little warm up. Just shake, shake your bodies a little bit here and there, here and there. Shake your bodies. Move your body. Okay, it's just a warm up. All right, march on your place. All right, couple seconds, couple seconds, okay? And then. That's it. Rotate your shoulders. Other way around. Okay. Your neck. Rotate your neck. Full 360 degrees angle. One more. And then reverse direction. Reverse the direction. All right. So, here you go. Uh, let's go ahead and get started. First, a little bit focus on upper abs. Lay on your back flat. Uh, legs folded. Hands behind the head. Let's do some simple crunches. Uh. Uh, in all the exercises, if you can, keep your uh, mouth closed and breathe through your nose. Okay? All right. So. Last one, okay. Next, what you're gonna do? Lay your uh, legs straight, okay, and cross, okay, this way. So you're gonna do cross. All right. Let's go ahead and get started. Uh, exhale when you come up, inhale when you come in. All right, next, let's do a plank and then we'll come back again on our backs, okay? Let's do some plank. Plank, you could do three ways. Um, this is your regular plank, okay? Um, if you want, you could do high plank, okay? Or if, you are, if you're a beginner, 
you can just do plank on your knees by resting on your knees okay you could also switch in between high and low if you want all right uh, let's go ahead and get started Couple more seconds here. All right. Let's do a full cobra. Let's stretch ourselves. Hand lay on your stomach. Hands by your side. Just push yourself up. Feel the nice stretch. Right now, since we are doing planks, let's do side planks. All right, rest on your elbows and bring yourself up. There's another way of doing it you can rest this leg here, and also you can raise either the legs are stacked up or this way. All right, focus on your breathing and let's get started. All right, let's switch sides, other side. You could, you could rest on your elbow or you could do this way too, whatever is comfortable for you. And again, legs stacked or legs this way. But try to focus, uh, try to breathe through your nose and uh, pull your abs inside. All right, let's go. All right, ah, oh, come down. Oh. Next, let's continue. Lay on your abs, oh, sorry, lay on your back. Hold your legs this way, like join your, your legs are joined, okay? See, your legs are joined this way. Lay it flat and crunch. That's for the lower abs, okay? Last one. All right. Next. I know we're going quite fast, but let's try to get maximum done. Leg straight. So you're going to do ankle touches. Okay. Just slightly, uh, you're above the ground, your neck is above the ground, and then you're going to do ankle touches. Okay. So here you go. Let's start. Last 
last one. Just drop your muscles where you're feeling the effect of the crunch. Okay. Next one. Let's again lie on your side. Twist your waist up. Okay. And then crunch. So this is to get that deep, uh, you know, you get a whole deep here. You see, I have good abs. So let's go ahead and get started. Make sure your knees are not, uh, I mean, you, you're not lifting your legs. Your legs are still touching the ground and stacked on top of each other. Last two. Other side. Let's do other side. Again, legs stacked on top of each other. Make sure you're not lifting your legs. And twist from waist up. So you get the crunch here. You get the deep hole here. Now if you want faster effects, you'll have to repeat the set. Because this is just one set. At least twice you'll have to do it. Okay. I'm going to be posting this video on my uh, YouTube channel. So please watch it there. All right. All right. Now let's do some exercise that gives the nice deep line in the between. Okay. We're going to do two different. One is regular bicycle crunches. Okay. And the other is like keeping your legs straight and then crunching on one side. Okay. So one leg straight. So my left leg is straight. Right leg is uh, knee bent. And I'm going to bring my right elbow to my left knee. Okay. So hands behind the head, exhale when you come up, okay? Try to breathe through your nose. Let's go ahead, get started. Last one. Switch sides. Last one. All right. Ooh, just shake your legs, move your knees side to side. It's just a quick movement for the abs. Touch it on both sides. Just a little stretch for all the muscles. Next, let's do bicycle crunches. We work in all parts of the ab muscles. Okay, all right. So let's go ahead and get started. So it's this way, opposite. Okay. Possible. Breathe through your nose. All right. Uh, 
abs tucked inside. Let's start. Last one. All right. Wow. That was it for today. Again, shake your legs side to side. Oh. Let's stretch our abs and do full cobra. It gives you a nice stretch. You can stay in that position for a little while. It gives you a nice stretch. Okay. Lay on your stomach. All right, hands by your side. Push yourself up. Make sure you're feeling the spread. Your ground or your groin should be touching the ground, okay? So let's go ahead and get started. Feeling the stretch? Good. Now let's transition to child's pose. All right. Sit. Thank you all for joining. Sit with your legs crossed, back straight, all right? Rub your hands. Rub your hands. Make a cup of your hands this way. Close your eyes and put your cup on your eyes. Right. Rub your hands on your head, removing all the negative energies, negative thoughts that are coming to you. Clean your aura. Uh, a quick tip if you want to increase the growth hormone, uh, cortisone, and all, a quick tip as soon as you wake up when the sun is still not that hot, um, get out of the house within the first half an hour that you get up, get out. Let some sun rays inside your eyes. But again, if you have some eye disease, eye infection and all, please consult your doctor before doing it. But that triggers a mechanism, the sunlight going in the eyes, the early morning sun rays, okay? Not like in the afternoon uh, or 10 o'clock or 11 o'clock, no, not those. The early morning when sun is not uh, high up and not as hot, okay? Uh, get some uh, eye, sun rays in your eyes. It triggers a mechanism inside the body that will trigger growth hormones and uh, uh, what do you call um, it will help you stay awake all day that you sleep better at night so everything is connected okay but again it will not work if you are sitting inside your car your windows are rolled up if you're looking through a glass basically no it won't work it ha you have to be outside and get direct sunlight you should not wear some sunglasses which prevents the uh, certain uh, what do you say wavelength of rays coming inside your eyes but again consult your doctor before doing anything of this sort if you have any sort of eye infection or disease and it has to be early morning sun rays cannot be um afternoon or uh, anything like that when the sun is too hot okay all right thank you all for joining again see you all next time until then take care bye